Okay then, testing, testing, one, two, one, two. And it helps if I unmute it. It helps if I unmute it. Okay, let's try that again. Testing, testing, one, two, one, two. There we go. Yes, yes, yes. Uh, good evening to you all. It is Thursday, the 22nd of September 2022. Uh, we're back with RPG Day, and we are going to be continuing our playthrough of Fire Emblem Path of Radiance. So while we finish setting up on my end, please get yourself a drink, get yourself a snack, and get yourself comfortable. We'll be back in a couple of minutes for Fire Emblem Path of Radiance. See you then. Hello, hello, and good evening to you all. It is I, Captain Steel 379 on the microphone once again, and a very, very warm welcome to you all, my lads, my lasses, my non-binary compasses. I hope you're all doing very well tonight. <sighs> I am doing... I'm doing... Okay. Uh, ooh, I see Mr. Robot is already in the chat. Hello, hello, and good evening to you. Uh, uh, sorry I didn't come to last night's stream. Hope you're well, Steel. Oh, that's very kind of you to say. Mr. Robot, don't ever be sorry about missing a stream. Don't ever be sorry about missing a stream. You know, life, you know, life continues. Life doesn't stop just because I hit the record button. Just, you know, don't ever, don't ever apologize. I mean, you, it, there's no obligation for you to be here. But I'm, but I'm glad that you're here now. I'm glad that you're here now. Of course I am. So, chat, we've got a brand new chapter. We've got a brand new chapter, chat. But let's uh, let's catch everybody else up who wasn't here yesterday. 
uh, yesterday, uh, Ike became Ike got his promotion from ranger to lord after being uh, given the lordship by Princess Elincia, giving him a major power boost. Giving him a major power boost. And talking about major power boosts, we also managed to get class changes or Pokemon evolutions, basically, for Reese, who evolved from a cleric to a bishop, which means he can now use offensive light magic, as well as Sorin evolving from a mage to a sage, which means that he had the option of going for a specialization duality of staves or knives. I chose staves because now that means uh, Sorin can be... A red mage, if I say a red mage, he can be effectively, <laughs> he can effectively be offense and defense, same as Reese now, uh, only that Sorin has like a, a tremendous amount of ele elemental magic at his disposal, so he can do both offense and healing. It's fantastic. We now have two amazing magic casters as part of our, as, a, as part of our troop, and of course Boyd and Oscar got their, got their evolutions. Uh, Reese, uh, sorry, Reese, Re Rayson. The Heron Prince joined the joined the team as well as the left and right hand of uh, King Tyban uh, or King Phoenix. Uh, so yeah, we've now got hawks, herons, tigers at our disposal. Two great magic casters. Ike himself, you know, uh, Boyd the Warrior. Uh, we even managed to find. I can't believe I'm saying this. We managed to find Shinon again. Uh, the archer that left us right at the beginning of the game after Sir Grell died. Uh, we managed to recruit him back into the party as well. And uh, Rolf is exceedingly close to being uh, to having his class change from archer to sniper. And I'm going to continue working on that one, chat. I'm going to be continuing to work on that one. But before we get on with the next chapter, before we get on with the next chapter... Let's get rid of the starting soon, for we have begun. Let's drop a link to our Discord server in the chat below. So if you want to keep up to date with goings on behind the scenes, new emotes, animations, etc., etc., please consider giving us a follow. And, uh, yeah, as soon as I'm back from that, uh, we can begin, chat. But also before we go, chat, before we before we go, before we start, chat, I'm in an exceptionally good mood today. I got some I got some really, 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 really good news. I got some really good news. My girlfriend is visiting in November. My girlfriend's visiting in November, and I am super happy and super excited. But okay. It is time, chat. It is time, chat. Chat, it's time. Chapter 19. Interested. Right, okay, here we go. I need to get on my uh, big boy voice acting pants. Although, to be quite honest, my voice acting is still terrible. <clears throat> Princess Silencia's newly found Crimean army, with Ike as its commander, marches to Torgaran and claims its first victory. Tor Garen is a vast wall guarding Dane's border, manned by battalions of well-trained soldiers. It was long thought impenetrable. Yet, the strength of the Crimean army under General Ike's leadership far outstrips Dane's expectations, and Tor Garen falls. Learning of Gallia's increased interest in the war, Ike wastes no time ordering his troops further into the heart of day. The Gears of History, which had come to a halt with the fall of Crimea, slowly creak to life once again. Thus beginning the next chapter. Chapter 19, Entry. Change of pace for tonight, actually, chat. I'm enjoying a nice warm drink when it comes to uh, when it comes to tonight's stream. I'm having peppermint tea. <sighs> okay. Naysala, King Naysala of Kilvas, I would speak with you now. Oh, 
if it isn't General Petrin. What brings you up to these frosty mountain peaks? <laughs> I have no time for pleasantries. Is it true? Has Crimea's army breached Tor Garen? Though I am loath to report it, that this appears to be the case. Ah, uh, Kayashi, you worthless dog! Being defeated by that girl's motley band just proves how useless he was. Oh, surely it's not the general's fault alone. He was told that Crimea's army was weak and that Tor Garen was impregnable. And yet, he was defeated. I'd say that someone severely underestimated our enemy, wouldn't you? What was that? You dare to insult Dane, Crow? Men have forfeited their lives for less. <laughs> insult Dane? Never. Come now, General Petrin, I was merely stating the facts. Regardless of the previous battle's outcome, Crimea's army will be stopped here. I will be taking the field myself. What? Hmm. <laughs> Sounds like you've set the stage for a grand performance. Oh, General Petrin, Kilvas will always stand at Dame's side, as long as we receive our payment, of course. <laughs> if gold is all it takes, then may our friendship never end. See to it your performance warrants such considerations. Hamasa, come here! Yes. Work with King Kilvas and put a stop to Crimea's army. No screw-ups or else! Leave it to me, General. I will not suffer another failure, King Kilvas. You must finish them and do so quickly. Are we clear? Ugh, I am sick to death of being made a fool by that Crimean floozy and her pathetic band of cell swords. And the remaining portion of my fee? Ugh, don't worry, we have it ready. You'll get paid when the job is done. <laughs> As long as we're clear on that point, everything's settled. Well then, I'm off. Dog's breath. Even by half-breed standards, these crows are complete scum. Give that one even the smallest opening and he'll steal the very eyes from your skull. What an untrustworthy wretch. She isn't wrong. Ike, I'd like to report the results of our last battle. Uh, yep, there we go. Okay, so we oh, we even got Tanith. That's right, we got the we got the head of uh, Benign's royal guard, Tanith, the Pegasus Knight, or sorry, the evolution of it, the uh, the v Falcon Knight, I think it is. Yep, we got that. Along with Soren, uh, uh, well, Soren was MVP, bunch of EXP, bunch of man money, cool. There were no deaths and no injuries beyond our capabilities to heal. Everyone performed exceedingly well. And that is all, and by your leave, I will excuse myself. Okay, so here we are again at the base. Okay, we're going to save it right now. Whew. Okay, here we go. In Fort Nation. Okay, we've only got three. Okay, we've only got three. Let's start off with Ulki. Uh, excuse me, do you have a moment? Oh, General Ike, what is it? I, it's nothing, really. I just thought I'd say hello. That's considerate. Um, your king is very generous, isn't he? And it's not just Rayson I'm talking about. He left us his two retainers as well. How do we pertain to the king's generosity? I guess it's just... I guess it's because Rayson kept apologizing. I just thought that... Am I misinterpreting something? I don't know. But I know that the king can survive without our help. Is that true? Huh, that's pretty amazing. I've been given, ti I've been given the title of Lord, but I still can't run this army on my own. Titanium and Sauron handle all the little details, and that's what keeps us from collapsing in a chaos. Our king does nothing special. Everyone just does what's needed. There is no chaos. Huh. He's really trusted, isn't he? 
that's natural. In Lagoo society, the, the strongest become king. Unlike the Bjork, kingship is not tied to blood, so we have no weak kings. Uh, I'm sorry, perhaps that was improper. No, no, I agree with you. Choosing a ruler by strength instead of birth makes much more sense. Hmm. When we face benign troops, we target the units with weak leadership and eliminate them first. Bjork weapons can be very powerful, but not everyone wields them well. Since Bjork also choose generals by bloodlines, their competency is uneven, and that is a weakness of Bjork armies. As for you, General Ike, the time to prove yourself is approaching. <laughs> Ugh, it's true. No matter how strong the individuals are, that strength is worthless unless they w they're weak as a unit. Sorry, it that strength is worthless if they are weak as a unit. An army's power comes from leadership and management. That's good to remember. Thank you very much. Hmm. Cool. <sighs> okay, here we go. Jenna. Brr. I'll take on any number of enemies, but this snow is another story, I'll tell you what. I think my beautiful wings were icing over. Uh, it sounds like trouble. Are you going to be able to fly? Yeah, of course I can fly. These wings ain't for looks, you know. They're made of flesh and blood and feathers. It's not like I'm some animal that has to hibernate when the winter rolls in. Sheesh. Can't you be orc tell the difference between comic exaggeration and serious conversation? Oh, uh, was I supposed to laugh? Uh, sorry about that. Oh my. <laughs> Such sincerity. This is unexpected. It looks like someone taught you manners, Bjork. Uh, oh, by the way, I've been meaning to ask, what are the chances of victory? <sighs> Honestly, we're still at an extreme disadvantage. What? Oh, that's not the answer I wanted. You gotta do better than that, Bjork General. I'm here. If we lose, how am I ever gonna show my face again in Phoenix? Phoenix, sorry. We're at a disadvantage, but I don't intend to lose. There's a man in Dane that I need to find. And I will be the last thing that he ever sees. Ha <laughs> ha. Well said, me lord. Well said, me lord. There you go. I wish you could repeat that to today's younger generation. Oh, there are some weaklings back at home I don't even want to call hawks. I'd love to stick them back in their eggs and start having from scratch. Hey, you hatch from eggs, eh? I was speaking figuratively, you know, like a metaphor. We haven't hatched from eggs in many generations now. Silly Bjork. All right, I'm out of here. I've got to warm, warm up the old wings before battle. Who knows what might happen? Uh, I figured that egg thing was a joke, but I had no idea it actually really happened. Hmm, bird tribes. Go figure. Okay, here we go, Jill. Bye, see ya! Yep. Yep. Oh, mist! Watch your step, it's slippery. Whoa! Mist! Ah, I landed right on my butt! Yeah, <laughs> the snow cold. Snow's cold. Be careful. Alrighty. Hey, watch, Jill. I'm gonna make a snow angel. Whee! Okay, mist must be kind of losing her mind a little. Ah. <sighs> It must be so nice to be so cheerful. Jill? Who's there? <gasps> General Ha? <Huh? clears throat> it's me. J Captain, oh sorry, Captain. Cap Captain Ha? Huh? But this is an enemy camp. I've been trying to track you down ever since you disappeared at Toha. I figured you were off chasing after the Crimeans. Though, I never imagined that you would join up with them. <laughs> Look, at first it was just circumstance, but now it's different. Now I'm with them because I want to be. Spending time with them and coming into contact with the Lagoos, it's shown me what a fool I've been. Lagoos? I never thought I would hear that word from someone who once said subhuman with such absolute hatred. Sounds like you've made some good experience. Sorry, sounds like you've had some good experiences with this happy little band. I knew if, that if anyone could understand it would be you, Captain. 
Hmm. So you're forming your own set of values for the first time. That's good. That's very, very good. But what are you planning to do now? If you keep moving forward, you're going to face General Jehurum. Jehurum? You're going to face General Jehurum before long. Causing trouble for my father was never my intent. However, as a member of this army, I will face him with my shoulders straight and my head held high. So you're determined to see this through? I am. <sighs> so be it. Then there's nothing left to be said. Farewell. The next time we meet, it will be as enemies. Prepare yourself and get some rest. You know how important that is. Ike, can I talk to you? A few minutes ago, a man I've never seen before just showed up and spoke to Jill. I'm not sure what was going on, so I went and found you. What did we do? Whatever they were talking about, it looked serious. Jill trained in the Dane army. Fighting against her countrymen will be tough. No matter how prepared she thinks that she is for this. I don't care what happens. You can't let her fight against her own father. All right, Ike? Hmm. It may not be a bad idea to keep her at the base camp. Just while we're in Tain. Okay, so some heavy shits going down there, chat. Some heavy shits going down there. Okay. Going into the support now. So who have we got? We've got Nafini talking to Brock. Brom talking to Fini, Shinon talking to Gatray, Gatray of course talking to Shinon, and that's about it. Okay, Nafini talking to Brom, let's do this. Well howdy Nafini, isn't it a beautiful day? Sorry, that's probably not the voice I did for him. <coughs> well howdy Nafini, isn't it a beautiful day? Mm, it sure is. I bet your hometown is real busy right now, what with the harvest season approaching and all that. Yeah, I bet. I'm sure my brothers and sisters are grumbling at Ma for making them help in the fields again. <laughs> All kids ever want to do is play. I should know. Say, how many people are in your family, Nafini? I have two younger sisters, three younger brothers. The boys are triplets, and they just turned six years old. Holy Christ, that's a big-ass family. Uh, huh. That's too much for your mom to handle all, all on her own. Yeah, I'm sure Ma chews them out every day. Uh, what about yourself, Brom? Ah, uh, my kids are a little older. I hope I hope they're helping Mother like they used to. <laughs> Don't worry about it, Brom. I'm sure they are. Ah, well, what a nice wholesome conversation. What a nice wholesome conversation. Okay. Now for these two chuckle fucks. Hmm. Huh. Oh, oh, maybe I should. Oh, well then again, I could. Mm, no, that won't do either. Mm, Zarbon. Hey. Mm. Oh, hey, Shannon. Mm, what in the heck are you doing? That's really annoying. Shh. It's a secret. Uh, whatever, see you around. Wait, wait, I'm joking. Hoo, ha. Stop being so mean and listen for a sec. I will, oh, I will if you buy dinner tonight. Mm, no. Oh, right. But you better give me some good advice. Of course, of course. So what's on your mind? I'm thinking about thinking about the reward. Okay. Hoo ha! I'm thinking about the reward that we're gonna get. I'm not sure what to do with it. It's up to you. Spend it however you want. But every time I spend money, you give me a hard time. I do. Now. Excuse me for a second, chat. Just someone. Okay. There we go. What about the other day when I bought the ultimate shield? <sighs> Gatre, that was a castle gate. Hey, did you ever give that back? That guard thought you were a thief. Hey, what about... And remember the speed ring 4000? Hoo-ha! That secret elixir that boosts speed by sprinkling all over your body. Uh, you mean that putrid snake oil? You dumped the whole bottle on your head without smelling it first. 
But that wonderful little potion worked. I did move faster. You moved faster because 30 stray dogs were chasing you. See, you're giving me a hard time again. Oh, did I hurt your feelings? Wow, it sure is fun to tell you the truth and have you grumble at me in return. No, no, I didn't mean to... Uh, sorry. Hmm, you're too honest sometimes. <laughs> you're, you're embarrassing me. All right, let's go eat. Now that's spending wisely. Yeah, let's... Hey, wait a minute, Shinon. Oh, you didn't help me at all. That isn't part of the deal. Ah, lovely. Okay, then. How much EXP have we got? Only 500 again. Oh, piss. Okay, so who exactly do we want to try and level up a little bit more? But before we do, in fact, before we do, chat. Ah. Uh, ooh, uh, convoy, we need to give Brave Bow Tornado. Okay, fantastic. Now, uh, we need to give the Night Killer. We need to give uh, give the last of the wind. Now, you may be thinking I'm insane, chat. But, but take this out. Uh, take back the wind. Oh, no, take back L wind. Give back fucking wind. Okay, now we take... Okay, we can't do that. Okay, we need to buy... We need to buy. Okay, we need to buy. We need to buy a heal. Soren can use heals. <laughs> How amazing is that? As I said, both offense and healing. Super cool. Okay, then we just need to give heal to you. And take out light. Wait, he can use shine already? Wow. Oh, of course. Because, um... Light's offensive magical capabilities is tied to the staffs that you can use. Oh. Oh. Oh, Chad, that's gonna be fun. Chad, that's gonna be fun. Uh, Boyd's absolutely fine. Beast is okay. Okay, this is the other thing we need to do, chat. We need to go to the forge. Yep. Iron sword. Oof, that's that's one hell of that's a uh, very expensive sword. Okay, so guaranteed, basically guaranteed hits. Uh, okay, so put up to one hundred. Let's put up to one hundred critical hit. Wow, that doubles the price. I would rather, yeah, I'd rather do that. To be quite honest. It'll cost you just under 2,000. Yep. Forge. Thank you. You want to change the weapon name? No. Give it to Oscar. Okay. Now what we can do, chat, is start working on Oscar using swords and lances. Oh, I'm so happy. I'm so happy, chat. Uh, we need to give Tanith a Volinary because that's the one we well, We didn't get the chance to before. Uh, same with all, same with all key. Oh shit! Didn't mean to do that. Uh, same with all key, and same with Tanith and Rayson. Uh, Mia, Janeth, Janeth. There we go. And Rayson definitely, definitely, definitely needs one. Where the hell is Rayson? Shit, that's a good question. Where the fuck is Rayson? There he is. Oh, he's got elixirs, but then again, I'd rather not use, uh, I'd rather not use elixirs. Ah, uh, there's nothing, I mean... No, you know what I can do? Oh my god, Jack, you know what I can do here? Not the Demi Band, not the Volinary, not the Volinary, no. There it is, Bjork Guard. Here's what we can do, we can trade. Uh, go racing. Okay, now we go back up to Rayson, we can equip him with Bjork Guard. A magic item that when equipped, half the damage done by Bjork attacks. Bitch. Because let's be completely honest here, chat. We are going to be able to use... Uh, uh, take... Oh no, you don't. You, my friend, get get a steel bow and a Laguz bow. Oh no, you get a long bow too. And you get fucking weak ones too. Uh, as for Rolf, Rolf, however, is going to take a hold of a uh, 
can't use that at the moment. Okay, fine. Uh, he is, however, going to grab a hold of the killer. I want to say killer. Yeah, we're going to we're going to give uh, we're going to give Rolf the killer. Because why the hell not? Uh, let's have a look. See. Okay, there's there's kind of not a lot else we can do here. Yeah, no, there's really not a whole lot else we can do. Yeah, the thing is, Rayson can't attack, like, at all. Can't use magic, can't use weapons, just... It sucks. <laughs> but okay, chat. Okay. That's it. We've now outfitted everybody with the basics that they need. Let us continue forward. Okay, we've got all the information. We've done all the support. Let's do this shit. The Dane border. Here. Yeah. So, General... There look to be a lot of enemy soldiers ahead. Mostly Dane, but there are some crows from Kilvas as well. Uh, more than our last fight? Oh yeah. There's a lot, but the most troubling is that troubling is that King Kilvas is with them. The Crow King himself is cooperating with Dane? Yep. And compared to the other crows, the king is in a class of his own. Obviously he's no match for our king. But uh, anyway, you should move carefully. An entire unit under the command of King Kilvas? I think that bit bodes ill for us. Uh, the, ba the outcome of the battle hinges on how we deal with them. Kilvas soldiers, hmm? As fellow bird tribe lagoos, what can you tell us about them? Here, don't lump us together with those carrions. We are not partial to the crows. As you know, we're outmanned by the Dane troops. Is there any way to get the Ravens to withdraw? That would be a tremendous help. Well, I suppose I could go meet with King Kilvas if I had to. I don't think that my speaking to him is going to make a difference, though. If you like, we will try, but don't expect anything to come of it. No matter the circumstance, I will never again speak to a crow. Uh, no matter what we decide, sitting here is giving the enemy more time to prepare. <laughs> You're right, let's get moving. Okay. We can only pick 13 units. Okay, we can only pick 13 units. Okay, let's actually see what we've got, shall we? Let's actually see what we have to fight. A ballist... Ooh. Okay, ballistas are basically giant bows that are going to do a shit ton of damage. Now if, I remember, now, if I remember this from my, uh, if I remember this from my very casual playthrough, uh, we need Racing to go talk to Nasala. Holy shit, they were not joking when he said he was in a class of his own. Look at those statistics! Yeah, we, uh, we need Nasala to get the fuck out of here, so we need Racing to go and talk to him very quickly. We need to avoid the baluster, okay? Yeah, we need to avoid the baluster, we need to get Rayson over there, and we need to uh, make sure he's protected with a bodyguard, so he'll kill... Actually, <laughs> which one is actually better for this job? Uh, Jeanne... 13, 11, blah, blah, blah... 15, 14... Oh, yeah, Ulk is better. Ulk is better as a uh, bodyguard for Rayson. Uh, we uh, definitely do not need so. Kenneth, uh, Austin, Heaney, Reese, Boyd. Okay, I'm happy with everybody else so far, so we get two units that we can pick. We're looking at swords, we're looking at one axe, we're looking at a sniper. I mean, we're looking at a bunch of sword users, so actually Nia may not be too terrible here. Plus, we want to try and level her up to sort to, to a, uh, we do, we do want to try leveling her up. Uh, and then we go Brom. Where's Brom? Okay, Brom's already selected. That's perfect. Um, hmm.
Do we have Kira? Yes, we do. Okay, I definitely want to try uh, getting Kieran up a couple levels. Yeah, okay. So, the thing is, we can always, like, start again, and we can always start again if we have to. Yeah, I'm actually more than happy with my selection here. More than happy with my selection here. Okay, so let's save the game. And let's get on with this chapter. Although what we could... In fact, what we do need to do is we do need to reposition Grayson right here at the front. Okay. We need Grayson and Ulki to take to the side and just, you know, keep uh, keep as far away from this particular bit of danger right here. I Do I risk Tanith going? I could actually. In fact, yeah, in, in fact, it is going to be better for Tanith to go. Instead of Kieran. Yeah, instead of Kieran, go Tanith. Okay, there we go. And then what we can do is we can reposition. And reposition. Okay. Uh, reposition. Okay, we should be good to go now. Uh, actually, no, if we... Yeah, do that. Okay, now we should be good to go. We have got a game plan, chat. Chat, we've got a game plan. We need to get Rayson over to Nasala with the protection of Falcon Knight and also uh, and also the other bird, the, the the hawk. Basically, if we can if we can talk to Nasala with Rayson, that takes the that takes all of the ravens out of the fight. And so long as we don't kill any of them, we're going to get a very special item. So let's do this shit. So the Crimean army has arrived. I hope they are prepared to pass into oblivion, or this will be their final resting place. Hmm. Crimean stragglers joined with an army on loan from Benign. I've even heard they have a betrayer in their midst, and yet they still march on. What an odd group. But as long as Kilva stands at the side of Dane, they have no future. Ah, uh, I suppose they're just... unlucky. It appears that the enemy has spotted us. Well, a group this large is hard to miss. How will you proceed? No tricks, nothing fancy. We'll hit them hard from the front. Fast and hard! I'm sure you're already aware of this, but if you don't do something about the kill vassals, you're at a disadvantage. Yes, I've heard... I've even, sorry, I, yes, I've heard about the ravens, but even so, it's not as if we can turn tail and run away. Now that I think about it, King Kilvas and Prince Raisin used to be close friends. Did you ask him to speak to the king? He was most empathetic in his refusal. It seems that Nesala was responsible for Raisin's capture at the hands of Duke Tanas. I can't really blame him. And the Hawks? They too are of the bird tribes. Surely some connection can be found there. They weren't very excited about the suggestion. You could command them to do it. There's an antagonism between the tribes that we don't understand. I would rather not force the issue. Trying to coerce them into doing it would be unfair. I'm going to let them do as they please. That is so very likely. However, giving orders that are unpopular is often necessary when one is in command. And... Maybe so, but I can only do things the best way I know how. My own way. It is time to go! Well, unfortunately, I'm not giving these fuckers the choice. So the question is, the ballista. Okay, so we can move... Okay, 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 okay. So yeah, we can move all the way over here and not be in any danger of the ballista whatsoever. Because remember, because we are of winged unit, chat, because we are of winged unit, we will take a hit ton of damage from uh, from this ballista if we don't take it out quickly. Okay, and then of course we've got this bloody thing. A wyvern lord and a wyvern rider. They are no joke. 
Okay, and we're Oh no, I just re- Don't tell me, don't tell me, don't tell me, don't tell me. Did I fuck? Oh my god, thank fuck there was no overlap. I'll admit, chat, that was a little bit stupid on my part. That was a little stupid on my part. Right, time to move forward. Equip the, uh, equip the new iron sword. Now, the reason why... This is why, okay? This is why, chat. Uh, we need Oscar to level up his sword-using ability up to at least level D so he can start using stuff like the steel sword, which is at least somewhat usable. But here we go. We're going to move the brothers up. We're going to move the brothers up. We're going to move Rom up. As well. Yeah, we'll keep, the, keep that. We're going to move Titania up. What a fucking powerhouse to start with. Okay, let's, let's, let's not kid ourselves, chat. Okay, this is a fucking powerhouse to begin with. Okay, so we can move Mia up too. That's fine. We can, we, we can move Mahini over here. We can absolutely move Reese over here. Absolutely we can. Move, move Wolf over here. Move Soren right there. And move Ike right up on the buck side end of those guys. There we go. Lovely, lovely, lovely. Okay. Uh, that is something we... Yeah, that's something we need to be very careful of. Okay. There we go. Sweet. Only three damage to the, only three damage to Brom. Let's hear it for that big defense. And remember, chat, lances are supposed to usually have a better chance against blades. Case and point. Case and fucking point. Oh my okay, okay, okay. Oh Wow, that did a that actually did a fair chunk of damage. The good thing Reese is bring up the rear. Oh, okay, here we go. My friend, you may have picked a terrible, terrible matchup here. Killer... <gasps> the killer axe. Ooh. Okay. Killer weapons, chat. Killer weapons have got higher critical hit chances than uh, your standard weapon. So, uh, yeah, I was a little bit worried about that, I will not deny. Oh god. Chat, we don't want to be we do not want to kill any of them, okay? Let's be completely clear here. We do not do not do not want to kill any of those guys. Uh, if I was to move over here. Is there a guide to ballistas at this point? No, just chat. Okay, oh, okay, okay, I know what we can do. We can move Tanith, one, two, three. Is it three? Okay, 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 I've got a visualization. Now, bring it back one, just to be on the safe side. Bring it back one, just to be on the safe side. There we go, now we can chant. There we go. Enchanting with Raisin means that we can move again with Tanner, which is perfect. Okay, however, we also do need to... Uh, we kind of need to start storming forward so we don't accidentally hurt anybody. Okay, and the main thing we need to take out is this... Uh, is this ballista. We do need to take care of that ballista. Double 16. That'll do it. Uh, can we... How big a defensive... In fact, we can build quite a nice defensive little perimeter right here. There we go. Lovely. No damage. Damn. Void is a man now. And a level up. Let's hear it. Let's hear it for the boy. Oh, sorry, let's hear it for the man. 
strength, skill, HP. Oh, he's he's a he's a fucking tank. He really is a tank, but uh, he really is a tank chat. Only we could move one more space. Actually, yeah, we can. We can actually. We can move Grom over. We go have Reese heal. Uh... We go have Reese heal Grom. Nice. Okay. Let's see what. Let's see what Mia can do here. Steel sword, double thirteen. Hey, it's a decent enough shot. It's a decent enough shot. And the decent enough shot is enough to do it. Excellent. Okay, how close are they to evolve? Okay, they're not close to transforming. Okay, so they're only going to come over here and start spewing very nasty messages. Just check something. Steel, steel. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. What we can do is we can uh, hang on a tick. There, there was another ballista. Was there not? Uh, can you? No, you. I don't think. No, he can't. He can't get to the ballista. That's fine. Okay, and what's your level of attack? Okay, okay. We're actually safe, chat. We're actually safe if we do this. That's fine. I needed to know. I needed to know, chat. That's all I needed to do. Uh, short spear, double 16, 99%. Yeah, fuck is dead. Fuck is dead. Jesus Christ! She was determined. Man, she was determined, Jack. Yeah, she was determined. Okay, shove racing forward. That's all. We, that's all we need to do, Jack. We need to just keep moving racing forward. At this point. Okay, here we go. Uh, yeah, she does not have a. Uh, but the, but that's but that's a bow made for killing the goose. Okay, so that's not going to do too much. Raisin, if you could avoid this, that would be fucking great, please. Sweet mama mia. Okay. Thank fuck. Okay. I'm glad, chat, I am glad I gave Raisin the Bjork guard. Okay. <laughs> Let's be completely honest here. If Rayson didn't have the Bjork guard, he would be dead by now, and we'd be having a 19-3 set on the books. And also, these guys are going to keep throwing themselves at Titania like fucking lemmings. Okay, here we go. Oscar's first use of the sword. Very nice. But again, as Oscar uses the sword more and more, his uh, like uh, double double hit chance will come into play. Okay, uh, Titania, we kind of need you to not hecking die, please. No! That's a reset, chat.
Damn. The one unit. Chat, the one unit I didn't think would ever die, died. However, our game plan is solid. Okay, let's not kid ourselves, chat. Game plan solid. Okay, so we're just going to start off straight away. Now, I just need to double check the overlap here. Yeah, it is genuinely just put yourself away in the corner, correct? It is, yeah, okay, it is genuinely just put yourself away in the corner. Okay, okay, okay. And the Bjork guard was a stroke of genius on my part, Jack. Yeah. Uh, just double check. Please tell me I haven't fucked up. Okay, so I didn't fuck up that one. And I didn't fuck up that one. Okay, that's absolutely perfect. We can work with this. Again, they're not close to a, they're not close to transforming, so we don't need we so we do not aggravate them in any way, shape, or form. Uh, no, no, I want to go. There you go. Move you forward. Move you up. We are definitely pushing. Equip an iron sword. For the time being, we definitely need to put a steel lance on. Okay, we just need to be very careful about where we're going to be positioning people. Move me up two, move the me up here, move Sovereign right about there, so he's just outside of the blast radius. Move, uh, move Reese up there, move Rolf up here, and then move Ike right behind everybody. Okay, chat. Let's try this again. Let's try this again, chat. Only two this time. That's cool. Well, oh, that's upsetting. Oh, good. Oh, that, ooh, that's actually not bad. And I'll tell you why, chat. That means someone else can get the kill. Okay, chat. Here we go. Here we go, chat. So, what exactly is your... So, if I move you up one, it's not going to be enough, chat. It isn't going to be enough. Chat, I'm just trying to think of the best way of doing this. Okay. Mia needs the EXP. Okay, let's be let's not kid ourselves. Mia needs the EXP here. Ooh. Sorry, 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 sorry. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I forgot to put my phone on to silent now. I'm so sorry, chat. Killer axe. Okay, so here's what we can do. We can grab the we can grab the axe from me. Okay, and then we can still do our movement. Uh, yeah, yeah. Okay, we should still be able to attack. Okay, still got the steel lance equipped, which is exactly what we want. Okay, Void is still going to use. There we go. Double sixteen. Perfect.
no damage. Oh, that that message is beautiful. That 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 message is beautiful. There's the level up. Boob. Okay, heal, heal Brom right up. Okay, who needs the HP more? Fifty one. Okay, so it's kind of fifty. So yeah, it's six and two threes really. Okay, and Titania is in a better position than she was. Let's not kid ourselves. Right, so here we go. I only move here. Grayson moves only here. We chant. up presenting a slightly better target and then double 16 here we go short spear okay here we go perfect so two ballistas down Very, very careful now, chat. Okay, move Ike forward. Move Soren forward. Excellent. Oh, that sucks. But okay. We should... <gasps> yes! Oh my god! Go, Rayson, go! Go, Rayson, you son of a bitch! Bye-bye. Uh, yep. <laughs> Titania is not happy at the fact that she lost in the she died in the last time. There's next. Okay, steel sword. Ooh, against the iron sword. Okay, here we go. Yes, excellent. Go, Oscar. Go. Okay, another one. Armor slip. Oh no. Uh. Ooh, thank heavens. Holy shit! Wow, Oscar. I thought you were a beginner with a sword, but damn. Damn. Skill and resistance up. Love it. I could have done with more physical defense, but fuck it. I'll take what I can get. Again, they're just gonna throw themselves at Titania like lemmings now that she has a proper fucking weapon for this job. Okay, 
Okay, yeah. That... Ooh, okay. Okay, this Wyvern Rider is uh, maybe shooting a little above his pay grade here. Yeah. Nice. Very nice. Go, Tanith, go. <laughs> shit, 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 shit. Oh, black wings. Amongst humans, these are considered bad omens, are they not? Then take these omens as fact, and let them herald you into the afterlife. Oh, no. No, 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 no. Don't do it. Mother! I won't deny, Chad, that, that's irritating. Why? Why? Why, Chad? Why? Okay, so I can push racing forward one more. I can push him forward one more. No, I can't. That sucks. Okay, that fucking sucks. Because uh, if I try and take out... Or is it the fact that I was right here? Is that it, chat? Is that the reason why? Is this particular is this particular square here exactly where Nesala wants us to be to aggravate the living piss out of us? Because if so, what we can do is try and attack from yeah. Okay, so we have a slightly different form of attack. We have a slightly different form of attack, chat. But we're going to do the exact same thing as we did last time. At least I think we are. Okay, let me just... Um... Okay, so everybody is can't pretty much where they need to be. Move you there, move you here. Move you there. Move you up here. And move you right behind here. And then move you up here as well. There we go. There's Nisala. Okay, now to just let everybody do their turn. Go, Brom, go! Okay.
And the thing is, racing's going to get attacked here. It's an unfortunate reality, but it's the reality nonetheless. Move up. Move Oki. Nah, because that's just a straight line. Now, there's an idea. Oh, no, he's got the short spear, so it wouldn't matter. Or would it? No, it wouldn't. Okay, 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 okay. I think, chat, I think we can absolutely do this. I think we can do it this way. I think we can do it this way, chat. Oh, you fucking have to be kidding me. We're already in ballista range, aren't we? No, not quite. Okay. Well, nobody else seems to be coming toward us at the moment. The question is, who exactly do we want to take this level up? We absolutely want... Oh no, because the ballista. This is just going to make things look all sorts of complicated. No, it's not. 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 Okay. 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 We're fine. We're good. We're okay. We're fine. I don't know how, chat, but I've managed to fuck this up. Is this going to be a 21st? Oh, thank This is legit. This is legitimately unfair. Double thirteen. Sorry, double seventeen. Okay. Good. Could you not have gotten that like one turn attack? Well, an attack before. I mean, don't get me wrong, I'm grateful for the level up, but still. Yeah, send the killer axe to the convoy.
Got no choice, gotta use the hand axe. Because we still need a way of defending ourselves, chat. Still need a way of defending ourselves, which we got, which we have. Love the void, love it. I mean, more HP is nice, luck and resistance, not exactly the greatest levels up, but I will take them. Heal Brom up once again. Now, unfortunately, there's just nothing. There is something I can do. Oh shit, who's just played the trash man? Uh, Thouse Likes Pie has uh, played the, I'm the Trash Man. Uh, Thouse, it's not lovely to see you. Okay, here we go. So, I need to use a Volinary. Then we can wait. Okay, this Ballista can't hit Ulki, can't hit Tanith. We're just about to get into a pissing contest with uh, with the spears that people can throw. Uh, hmm. There's no guarantee of a defensive perimeter, or is, or is there? Hmm. What are we looking at here? Armor Slayer. I mean, uh, Armor Slayer is specifically. Yeah. Okay, so... No, no, that's just the organ knife. Steel, iron, long... Okay. Heal up, Oscar. Uh-oh. I forgot we couldn't do that. My bad. Lance again. Okay, we can move Mia over there. Your Lance, perfect. Slim sword. Oh, yeah. Slim. Uh, ooh, ooh. Uh, we need to move. There we go. Okay, here we go, chat. Okay, here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go. Okay, we've already suffered a couple of losses here. We've already suffered a couple of losses here, and Orki should have transformed. Okay, but thankfully, this Ballista, which, is, which you know, we, we really do not want to aggravate, okay, cannot hit any of the three flying units in which they would do super effective damage, which is, you know, our greatest boon at the moment. Uh, however, it can... Who, did, who can it hit? And it can't even... Okay, the only person that this can hit now is Void. Void can, is built. Void is built to take hits like this. Close to close to transforming. Close to... Okay, not too close. Just don't aggravate them. Okay, here we go. I'm sorry? Uh, what the fuck does it do? A sorcerer's blade that uses magic, not strength to attack. And it does that much damage. Really? Good god, man. Okay. So, it looks like we're Sonic Sorting this. Okay, I didn't know flashing screen. Sorry, flashing screen warning. Yes! Yes! She lives another day, chat. Just stay right there, bitch. Stay right there. Stay right there. Because the one thing we need to do is take out this guy, and then we need to get Raisin over to Nasala. That's basically it. We need to get Raisin over to Nasala so that Raisin can talk some sense into him before any ravens get killed. 
okay, just so we can get a hold of that nice commemorative uh, ring. However, I think that fucker is just about to throw himself at the problem. God, I hope not. <laughs> Go, boy. I mean, yeah, he was at he was at a disadvantage due to the weapons and goddamn it showed no damage. But damn, our beefy man can take the hit and deal out the damage too. Okay, here comes the armor slayer. This is what I was worried about, chat. For that reason alone. Ooh, Ooh. wow. Uh, I just felt something. I just felt something go uh, incredibly tight in my chest. Okay. See, absolutely, no, yeah, nowhere near, no, nowhere near the damage that the other guy did. Nowhere near. Okay, and the longsword, remember, is only designed to be taking, is designed to be taking out horse, uh, horseback units. Using him, using the longsword against uh, someone like Boyd is kind of stupid. And look at that, Boyd is so beefy, he only took two damage from that. Okay, now Nafini has got the advantage when it comes to weapons. And damn it, does it show. Nice. And that is not nice. A fucking level up with no stat increases. You useless turd. And that's the second of Racer's uh, passive ability. The fact that he can heal units just by being close to him. Okay, we have got proper defense. Yeah, we've now got a proper defense going. Okay, now the last time we did this chat, we attacked from this square against the archer. That proved to be very, very bad. Oh, okay, so... Fully heal. Uh, double 16 or double 97. Uh, sorry, double 16 or double 15. Okay, doesn't really matter. Let's attack with the, uh, let's attack with the short spear here. Okay, fantastic. Full health. Full health. Okay. So, what we now need to do is move Olki up just a touch. Move Racing up a touch. Give Olki a chance. Because the thing is... The thing is, we've seen how aggressive Nesala is, okay? We need to be able to just swing in and out very quickly. Okay, when it comes to when it comes to King Kilvas over here. Oh no, 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 don't, don't tell me. Please do not tell me. Don't fucking Don't tell me. Please. Have I been going about this the wrong way? Have I been going about this the wrong way, chat? Oh god, I hope not. Oh, here we go. Okay, we've got a lot of transformations happening. Chat, we may be seeing the 21st reset here. I completely forgot to heal up my guys. Oh, I'm an idiot. I was so focused on racing and 
King Kilvass that I forgot about everybody else. What an absolute boob. Longsword is useless to, to Void. Oh, that's bad. Shit! <sighs> 21st reset, chat. 21st reset. Okay, that was entirely my fault, though, chat. That was entirely my fault. That was genuinely entirely all my fault. Okay, and I I think I'm only going to get one more chance at this. Depending on depending on how long this takes, I may only get one more ch one more try at this. The thing is, I've got a sound strategy. Chat. Okay, I've got a sound strategy, which is to avoid the ballistas, okay, then take out this fucker, then bring it around town to attack Naysala. Well, t to convince Naysala to stop being such a douchebag. Because it's, uh, it's, it's, as, it's as, uh, as the guy said. Uh, Naysala is the reason why Rayson was sold into captivity in the first place, so, uh, yeah, kind of a bit pissed. Which, let's be honest, is completely reasonable. I keep trying to copy what I did the first time, and I just can't seem to replicate it, chat. Yeah, that's that's one thing I do like about Path of Radiance. You can actually see how you can see how far your opponent can travel, attack, etc. And then you can make your best uh, best moves with the information you've got. Now we've only have got we do only have a few turns, chat. We've only got a few turns. Love that. Oh, nicely done, Brom. Nicely done. Why couldn't you have done that before? Okay, then. Then all these guys come forward. Okay. Now, the th now, again, the thing is, Chas, we want to try and double dip here. We do want to try and double dip. Okay, and actually, we can absolutely double dip here. So, here's what we need to do. Okay, we need to move. Okay, so Racing can move up to about here. But we do have to be careful of this Wyvern Lord. So, what we... Mm. We can move Tanith up here. Because if we have a look, yeah, Tanith is only like a couple of squares away. So if we can move her up, yeah, if we can move up here, use the chant, which gives Tanith her turn back. Okay, the thing is, though, we are going to be able to take out the second ballista, okay? So, here we go. Got to use the hand axe because Boyd needs a... 
Actually, let's actually check this out first, okay? Okay, if Oscar can get the if Oscar can get the hit that I want him to. No, he doesn't. A shame. It's a shame. Okay, but that does mean that uh, unfortunately we are going to have to uh, modify our plans ever so slightly. Here we go. We get to we have to modify our plans ever so slightly here, chat. I mean, not that you needed to avoid it, dude. You don't take any damage from that from that schlub. they needed it more? Technically Mia does. Uh, but before I do, uh, yep. Oh no, that's just outside of the range. But Mia, you lucky bitch. Mia, you lucky bitch. Damn, she just fucking decapitated the guy. Nicely done. Okay, we can now come up and heal... Heal Brom, which is what we want to see. Okay, how close is that armor-slaying piece? Of He's right there. You know, I was just about to ask how close that armor-slaying piece of garbage was, but there uh, you yeah. <laughs> Oh no, I've just realized. What have I done? <sighs> just outside of range. Damn. Nafini's still at full health, so she can uh, hopefully do some stuff. Bring I forward. And roll forward. Okay. And then what we can do is we can bring Uki. Uh, let's have a quick look, see. Yeah, we can move Tanith forward one. Okay. And then we can move Olki up all the way up here. Actually, it really won't matter which side we put put him against Raisin. Okay, there we go. Cool. <laughs> what a little bitch. Okay. Remember, chat. This is this is a bow designed specifically for Lagoo, so it wouldn't do too much damage. It'll be annoying, but it's not take. It's not doing too much. Okay, here we go. Okay, here we go. So this guy's getting into a bit of a pissing match already, which is which is what we're gonna see. There we go. Come on. There's one. The crit. God damn. She just crit him straight through the goddamn heart. So that's one less worry to worry about. Only two. You know what? Two's fantastic. Uh, is that a dragon and a pegasus? Yes. Yes, it is. But uh, the Pegasus, but that Pegasus, it, he may be a beginner with the sword, but damn it, all Oscar has given it is all. Uh, but yeah, that is indeed a dragon and a Pegasus because, um, well, technically a wyvern. It's actually technically a wyvern because you also have dragons as well. 
So, uh, yeah. Uh, the Knights of Dane, which is the country that we're currently attacking, is known for its uh, wyvern riders. Fearsome knights of the air. But then again, the kingdom that we just helped out, Benign, is also known for its Pegasus Knights, which are also warriors of the air. Chat, we may just be able to do this. We may be able to do this, chat. Okay, so the first thing we need to do is absolutely take care of this short... Uh, uh, yeah, take care of this ballista. And we also need to make sure that this guy can't actually get there, as on, get there either. So... We need to clear away to the uh, to the ballista, and we need to make sure that uh, sniper can't get it. Okay, kid, well done. Close to a level up. Damn. Got a longsword. Kind of heckin' useless to us. How far can Tanith go? Okay, so Tanith can attack you. thing is though, Chess, I am ge I'm genuinely terrified of Nesala attacking. Nesala is the king of ravens for a very good reason. Okay. Do not, ki don't kid yourself. Won't lie. As much as I would love, as much as I would love Oscar to keep using the sword, he's got to go back and get himself a, uh, get himself a heal from and remember, chat, don't forget, uh, Reese is now a bishop. He class, le he class leveled up uh, in the last episode, which was fantastic. Iron blade, iron blade, steel sword. Hmm. Okay. Send Brom into battle. We have advantage, and if Brom is able to land this hit, you know, get some EXP, get some EXP. Good man, good man. That's what we all, that's what we want to see. I am genuinely afraid, chat, of like uh, aggravating the piss out of Nisala, but I don't have a choice here. I don't have a choice. I've got to, got to, got to get rid of this guy. Okay. Target neutralized. We can now move all we can now move Olki up and we can also move Rayson. Uh how far can you travel, my friend? Actually now, if we start moving toward yeah, start moving toward Tanith. Okay. That's fine. Now, let's not repeat our earlier mistake, chat. Okay, so this guy's blocking it all off. So, oh. So. What do we do? Double 22. Yeah, okay, this guy's gone. Okay, let's be completely honest here, chat. This guy's gone. Titania just annihilated the guy.
What did I just get? What? Excuse me? Chat, uh, I'm afraid I have got to call the bullshit on that one. Okay, now my opponent cannot use that ballista, which is fine by me. Uh, and someone needs to continue leveling up. I mean, yeah, his stabs. Uh, yeah, yeah. Uh, but also his electricity and fire. Okay, flash and screen warning. No, Sauron, what are you doing? Man, Sauron effectively just did the equivalent of putting a toaster in a bathtub. You didn't have to go that hard, dude. Okay. Here we go. This this is where this is where the mission is mo made or broken, chat. Chat, this is where the mission is made or broken. Bated breath here, chat. Okay. All this will do is make Ulki evolve. I keep saying that. This will just make Ulki change into his fork form in the next turn. Is Nisala aggravated? Fuck! That's a yes. Tanith dies. Tanith dies. What time is it? Quarter past nine. I have to, I'm gonna have to call this chat. I'm gonna have to call it. But we are gonna start. Okay, I can always, I can always suspend the chapter if I need to. I can always suspend the chat if I need to, chat. I have got... I now have a different idea of what to do. I've got a different idea of what to do. Okay. Cars. Are you fucking kidding me? Are you actually fucking kidding me? I can't... He can't attack behind. The stupid thing can't attack from behind. So there goes my fucking plan. an idea it's a it's a ridiculous idea but it's an idea nonetheless
It's a ridiculous idea, chat, but it is one that may work. I'm going to put Brom in this area. We're going to force this ballista to use all of its shots. It only has five. And then we can force the little shit to come out and, uh, you know, fight like a man, basically. I mean, is this going to work? Who knows? But it can't be any worse than the uh, than the previous attempt. I need to bump. I need to bump up my. Uh, I need to bump up my uh, reset to twenty-two. Okay. So, here's the plan chat. The problem is just going to stand there as a fucking target. Okay, let's see if Oscar can actually do this this time, shall we? choice we have got to get rid of this ballista user the two best words we could have seen today. no damage That's a great level up. That's actually a fantastic level up. Let's hope we get to fucking keep it this time. Now, does Titania, uh, the only one she has is Hand Axe, and we can't afford her to have that. Also need to try and aggravate the living piss out of this wyvern rider. So nah. what I can do is I can just farm for a little bit of the XP with uh, with racing here. Maybe I'm doing something wrong. Chat, maybe I am doing something wrong. No, because every single time we do something on this fucking useless island, 
Maybe I just need to wait for Nasala to transform back. about where we're placing units at the moment. That's all. Because the last thing we want to do, the last thing that we want to do, is have a repeat performance here. I don't mind. Now I don't know if that's two or three. I d okay, I don't know if that's two or three chat, so I'm gonna have to double check that. I think that's only two. Jesus Christ, Oscar, fucking calm down, man. Eh, a decent level up. Oscar has been taking a fucking ass kicking. You took a goddamn art. Wow. To put that into perspective, that's the weapon that killed Titania all that time ago. Uh, yeah, let's not kid ourselves. Oscar really does need to go back and get a heal. But damn, he took a he took a fuck ton of, ton of punishment. Let's not kid. Let's genuinely, genuinely not. Uh, let's genuinely not belittle what this he did there. And look at that. Reese is now so powerful that even the weakest heal spell that he casts can heal someone all the way back up to 100%. Uh, Ballista has four shots left on. Fuck me. Go Sonic Sword. Flash and Scream. Again, just 
farm a little bit of EXP for raising here. Because racing, racing's chance allows units to move for a, for a second time in one turn. Uh, okay, cool. Yeah, we can just move you right now. Perfect, the Mundo. Okay. So, what can we do here? Again, we need to be very careful where we're going to be putting people. Just outside of range, which is what we want. And Nafini is in range. Which is unfortunate. Hmm. Okay, Nafini gets the kill, which is fantastic. She is so close to to getting what she needs. Not exactly a useful item here. Okay, Ike now gets the kill on the sniper, which is exactly what we want to see. We're close. We are close to do we are close to doing this chat. It's just such a pain in the backside. Okay, uh, we're both not likely to hit each other, but uh, it's better than nothing. Okay, there we go. Perfect. problem there, chat. Oh, that's bad. Okay, that's not too terrible. I mean, she isn't... I mean, she, yeah, she's taking some damage. Holy shit! I mean, at the, uh, at the same time, I'm a little disappointed, chat. Yeah, I'm a little disappointed about my life. I can't help but feel, chat, this is going to aggravate Nesala. And if so, then I need to, uh... I need to come back to this next week. I'm just seeing what happens, to be honest, because... The unfortunate thing is, by killing a raven... We would not get... We wouldn't get the special item at the end of this the end of this uh, mission anyway. What we really wanted is for that guy to leave us the fuck alone. But okay. Tell you what, let's just, let's just end. I need to look up how to do this perfectly. Okay, I need to learn how to do this perfectly. 
Okay, so this guy is coming into a fight he can't win. Yep, that aggravates him. So, unless, unless, Ulki avoids this. Okay. Well, what's this? Well, if it isn't one of my beloved hawk cousins. As you can see, Kilvass has sided with Dane. Try not to think too poorly of us. That's a two-hit knockout, isn't it? And he fucking is with a crit. Kiss my ass. Okay. You know what, chat? That one was deliberate. Well, I do hate to say it, chat. I really do hate to say it. But, uh, yeah, tonight's stream has ended in catastrophic failure. We could not get past this roadblock. We couldn't get past this roadblock. Uh, I'm not I'm not going for another try because that's now 25 to 10. I need to be getting ready for bed because I have got work in the morning uh, Yeah, I'm going to look I'm going to actually look up a uh, I'm gonna look up a video. Okay. I'm, I'm not gonna lie chat. Okay. I'm just gonna look up a video how to do this Because I've tried t two different methods three different methods now and I am I'm losing my mind slightly And the only reason why I even went after that ballista pilot in the first place is because we killed that raven. The thing is, we need to kill no ravens at all. Get Rayson to talk to Kilvas. And then we get ourselves a very special item that can work for anybody. Uh, called a Night Ring. I don't know how, I can't remember how the hell I did it before. But somehow I did. Naysala is on a different level. Genuinely on a different level. So yeah, I'm just gonna I'm just gonna watch a video and see how it's done. So yeah. Bit disappointed, I'm not gonna lie, I'm a bit disappointed in tonight's stream, but you know, not every stream can go as smoothly as everything did yesterday. So uh tomorrow is Flexible Friday. I don't know what I'm doing yet. Okay, and I am not in the correct headspace to say what we are going to do. Uh, what I can say, though, is that we are going to do a a 60 to 90 minute Smash Brothers stream as, we've, as we have been doing for the past week. Uh, tomorrow at some point, probably, I don't know, about 11 o'clock. I want to say about 11 o'clock, just before lunchtime. And then... Uh... Oh. Excuse me. Um, and then... Uh, yeah, and then uh, tomorrow evening is Flexible Friday. I, ju I just don't know what we're going to do. Uh, thank you all very, very much. It's been a privilege, as always, to stream for you. And now I'm going to go and sleep like the dead, watch that video, and I'm going to curse myself for not having, for having not done this correctly. That doesn't seem easy, though, Chad. Let me be completely honest. That really does not seem easy. Um, so, yeah, no, thank you very much for joining me on tonight's stream. I really do appreciate it. Thank you all very, very much. I will see you tomorrow for, for Smash Brothers as well as Flexible Friday. Uh, again, not too sure what I'm doing. I might do some uh, Super Super Mario Party. Might do some Mario Kart. Might go back to JoJo's. I'm not 100% sure. As I said, I can figure it out tomorrow. Have yourselves a lovely evening, chat. Stay safe. Thank you again. And remember, and if you know the saying, I want you to say it with me, chat. When life gives you garbage, 
grab life by the throat, and you make it feel the steel. You make it feel the steel. I will see you tomorrow for Flexible Friday and Smash Brothers. Everybody, thank you again. Have yourself a wonderful, wonderful evening. Stay safe. Bye-bye. I'm so I'm so annoyed. I need to I need to actually look at this. Okay, what chapter is it again? Eighteen? Uh, no, it's nineteen. Yeah, chapter nineteen. Right. Have to get, no, 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 that's not what I want. Okay.